Hello, and welcome to UBL TV. Today we're going to take a look at the Phoenix 4200 controller. This all-in-one controller is state-of-the-art and one of the most robust and affordable on the market. And it now even includes data link to make wiring even easier. Included, you'll find the control head, the instructions, the relay module, the RJ45 wires, a U-bracket, and a USB cable for programming. The module control head connects to the power supply via the RJ45 cable. Also included is a U-bracket to mount the control head. Thanks to the control head's small footprint, it can be easily mounted to a dash or in the console. Face plates for all the major manufacturers are available on our website. The power supply features 20 programmable outputs, including a built-in wigwag. There are programmable inputs for nighttime activation, park kill, high beam, override, and etc. The controller has 18 programmable buttons. Each button can be programmed on off, momentary for pattern changing or siren tones, or a timer switch for gun locks. With 50 legends per button, you are sure to find the perfect label. The control head has a three position slide switch. This switch can be set to turn on as many or as little buttons on the keypad in each position. With the optional Bluetooth module, you can control the controller with your iPhone, iPad, or Android device. You can also connect the 4200 to a Storm Pro like the 100 watt or the 200 watt. The 4200 is programmed with an easy to use free software download available on our website. The 4200 is compatible with both Phoenix and other brand 12 volt lights. The compact power supply handles nearly anything you can throw at it quickly and effectively. The base of the power supply is constructed of aluminum, ensuring efficient heat dispersion. Five fuses add additional protection to the circuits. This system is truly a no-brainer. Also, this controller carries a two-year manufacturer's warranty, and it's made in the USA. For any additional questions, feel free to contact us. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.